do you sense a need, an appetite for spectacle in the audiences? Uh, I'm not sure it's a need, uh, but uh, like you, I have an appetite for that sort of uh, that sort of thing. I crave it sometimes, you know. Um, I crave spectacle sometimes on the stage. I mean, I've seen so much of uh, of uh, I've seen many plays and much scenography of a kind of darkish nature. You know what I mean? And and I can do that one at any time. It's uh, it's. But it seems very, very little of the repertoire that we work, uh, that we produce, requires that kind of thing, you know. That's why I welcome the opportunity to work on this, uh, this new production of Guys and Dolls here for, the, for this theater. Um, because, well, mostly because, never mind, you have, a, you have a wonderful range of characters. These guys are amazing, the roles for men. You have two great parts for women, too. And you have three massive musical numbers to stage. You have that great number, I Love You, a Bushel and a Peck, <laughs> which is totally, it's totally a silly number. But it, it also has classical, um, it's something in the 18th, you know, like, for example, the little shepherd girl who goes out into the, the shepherdess, who goes out into the field to, to gather the eggs or the ears of corn or something. And she's dressed like in a bonnet, you know what I mean? And she's dressed like, a lot of 18th century aristocrats, women would have their paint, pictures painted as a shepherdess. Well, this number, I Love You, a Bushel and a Peck, is about that very same thing. It's about cute little girls going out into the barn to collect the eggs, you know what I mean? And this, well, it is. <laughs> okay. it's, it's called Miss Adelaide and her farmerettes. And her farmerettes? Okay. Farmerettes. Okay. And, and it's, a, it's a direct reference to 18th century shepherdesses. It, it is. You're kidding. Really? Of course You're making is. this up. No, I'm not making this up. Why should I make that up? I mean, so Marie Antoinette is the uh, link to guys. Not and Marie dolls? Antoinette, but little girls dressed as shepherdesses doing things on a farm, and maybe the <laughs> the farm boy might meet her behind the haystack, and there might be a little porking going on. You know what I mean? Or it's it's all about that. Okay. It's all about a kind of bucolic um, horniness, if you like. You know what I mean? That's what I love you, Bushel and Peck is about. So, I mean, you get to stage that as a musical number in a nightclub floor show context, right? Miss Adelaide and her farmerettes. Come and see it, boys. You're going to love it. And then you got Take Back Your Mink. Talk about spectacle. Now, that is a classic strip tease number right. in which take back your mink take back the pearls. What made you think I was one of those girls? And take back the thing. So, you know, they get it off. So that is also staged in a, in a, in a, as a nightclub floor show with an MC and the whole thing. I mean, it's wonderful.